Hi, this is Wong Sun Kim from Plastic Surgery Department of the RWTH Aachen University in Germany and I want to shortly introduce you a paper called The Effect of Lipoaspirates on Human Keratinocytes which was selected for the September 2016 issue of the Aesthetic Surgery Journal. Of course, I want to thank Professor Palua, the Director of the Department, Professor Renka for former senior attending, our medical student Shao Gao, as well as all other co-authors for their contribution to this study. We all know that fat grafting is a very common method in plastic and reconstructive surgery to treat cutaneous defects and usually liquefied lipoaspirates are used. But while there are many experimental studies that investigated the beneficial effect of on block adipose tissue condition medium or adipose tissue cell fractions, very limited data is actually available on the effect of liquefied lipoaspirates in particular. So in this study, we compared lipoaspirates, which were harvested and processed by the Coleman protocol, with on-block adipose tissue, which is adipose tissue without any further manipulation on keratinocytes. And we show that actually lipoaspirates and on-block adipose tissue had very, very similar effects on keratinocyte viability, differentiation, stratification, or migration but we also saw significant differences in the proliferation of keratinocytes. I think there is a need for a more precise evaluation of this technique because after so many years we still do not understand why and how adipose tissue helps tissue to regenerate when it's transferred from one anatomical site to the other. For more details, I however encourage you to have a look into our upcoming publication in SJ.